All right, guys. So uh, today, uh, let's quickly learn about uh, uh, Azure um, PowerShell commands. I've currently logged on to the server, and uh, prerequisites for is you need to install the, the PowerShell. You can download from uh, Microsoft uh, website, and also you need to install the uh, all the required Azure uh, uh, PowerShell uh, modules. All right, so in order to uh, connect uh, to your Azure subscription and you want to see what virtual machines that are up and running, how many resource groups are there, what are the storage accounts uh, that are created, and, and et cetera. So these are the, the basics. You should uh, be uh, well working with the, these basic commands. All right, so the, um, the first command I would like to show is, uh, you should understand how to log on to the uh, Azure subscription using your uh, Outlook account or Hotmail or your uh, company uh, email address, okay? So for that, uh, you need to type in login, Azure. See, so automatically it will populate uh, the, uh, the command. So login hyphen Azure RM account, all right? So this is, this is for the new portal. That is portal.azure.com, all right? Select this one, RM account tab enter and get a pop-up window all right so so where you'll be typing your uh, your email address it can be your uh, outlook hotmail or it can be your uh, company email address okay so in this case uh, i'll be using a, a different uh, uh, a test uh, outlook account for you so that will be um, measure it uh, at azure toolkit.co and um, so now uh, I've connected to my subscription so it gives the, the account the tenant ID subscription ID and the subscription name currently I'm using it's a free trial or it's a pay as you go Okay, so this is the, the first command you should be knowing. Or if someone asks you how you connect uh, to Azure uh, portal using PowerShell, so this is the command, it's login hyphen Azure RM account and press tab on your keyboard, okay? press enter you'll get this window and you will type your email address here okay all right so now the second command I'll type CLS now we are already connected or uh, let me quickly um, connect to this uh, once again Okay. So now uh, we are connected to the uh, test subscription. Now I want to see uh, I want to see what are the resource groups uh, that are that are present in my subscription. For that, get hyphen Azure. RM resource group, all right? So it's like get hyphen Azure RM resource group is the, uh, is the command to see for all the uh, uh, existing resource group groups. Okay, so it will list all the uh, existing, uh, uh, the group wise name, okay? And the location and the provision, provisioning state so if you look at it, it clearly shows uh, 
the group name the location and the provisioning state and also you can see the tags uh, for the resource id all right the resource id is is always mapped with your subscription id okay so if you look at here it shows subscriptions slash the resource id and uh, the resource group okay here uh, in this case we have two uh, resource groups one is the cloud toolkit and the second one is the testing environment and the location is east us and the provisioning state is succeeded all right so this is this is the uh, the second uh, useful command all right for you and let's uh, now i want to see uh, the storage accounts so for that i'll be using get azure rm storage account so get azure rm storage account press enter it will list all the storage accounts in the subscription all right so i'll just scroll up a little bit or i can just window like this okay so so i've got uh, it shows uh, the resource group name storage account name the location the sku all right and also the the creation time followed by the uh, one second sorry guys so uh, you can also check the uh, the, the the status of uh, uh, the primary and secondary tags here okay and whether we have any endpoints provisioned also for this okay and now uh, if you look at the uh, if you scroll down it will also show whether there is encryption enabled for you in in, in the storage uh, and also uh, whether there is any uh, uh, last geo failure happen for the storage accounts all right and also you can see uh, whether uh, this is a primary or a secondary storage so the status of primary is it, it says available so this is the primary uh, storage uh, created okay so in in simple terms uh, I'll, I'll scroll down okay in simple terms if i'll uh, if i go back here all right so i can see here we have one more uh, resource group name which is testing and environment storage account name testing uh, uh, environment disk 595 all right and uh, you can see uh, the id of the storage account ids the location all right and also you can you can check the uh, what sk it is using it is using microsoft.azure management.storage.models.sku all right and uh, the creation date okay and uh, the primary location so yeah, you will not see all this information. Uh, I mean, most of the information will be listed under Azure subscription. However, yeah, you cannot see whether uh, you know the the SKU type or uh, the, um, the the tags or uh, status of primary, secondary, and also the uh, the context and also uh, uh, last geo failover time, custom domain. All right, so. So you will not have this 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 kind of uh, uh, information available, all right? So this is the third command, okay? Okay, let's let's do a quick re uh, recap. The first thing we have done is a login a hyphen Azure RM account, the first one, all right? The second one is get Azure RM resource group, all right? And the third one is get Azure RM storage account, all right? So this is how you will be uh, uh, connecting your uh, connecting to your Azure subscription. You will check the resource group's name and you will check the the storage account. Now, I want to know about what are the uh, the VMs that are uh, that are up and running or that are present under any uh, Azure subscription or my uh, test Azure subscription for that. Get Azure. RM VM. Okay. So it's get hyphen Azure RM 
It's nothing but resource manager. VM is, stands for virtual machines. Press enter. So it will list all the resource group name, the name of the server, the location, the VM size, the operating system type. It can be a Windows or a, a Linux or, a, or, or and also what is the NIC and the provisioning state. Okay. Got it. So these are the, the basic information you should be understanding. And if you want to know uh, the, uh, you can type get Azure RM and you can type uh, VM. You can press tab that will give various commands for you under that particular uh, this thing. Okay, so I want to see uh, storage, storage account, storage account key, name availability, storage account usage. So let's see, uh, get uh, Azure RM storage usage by press enter. So it says uh, localized name is storage accounts, name is storage accounts. The unit is count, current value is four, so I have four storage accounts created, okay? And the limit is 200, okay? And the next command I want to show is Azure RM, okay? You can scroll down, you can see all various get Azure combination, um, information here okay so there are so many commands here you can you can check so i want to see uh, virtual networks. So get a hyphen Azure RM virtual network. Press enter. So it gives all my existing virtual networks information. Okay. So let's see quickly. It gives the name, resource group, location, ID, e tag, resource good, provisioning state, DHCP options, address space. The subnets. Okay. We have the subnets here. Okay. Okay. So, and it also gives a network uh, appearing. And this is one more, uh, uh, one more VNet testing uh, ENV hyphen VNet. All right, so it shows we have two uh, virtual networks created in this uh, subscription. Okay, so this is how you will find. All right, so let's quickly uh, recollect all the commands that we learned today. It's first thing is login hyphen Azure RM account. Second one is get Azure RM resource group. Get Azure RM storage account. Get Azure RM VM. Get RM storage usage, get Azure RM virtual network, okay? So this is how uh, you will be uh, uh, using the, the PowerShell to connect and to, to get information from your existing Azure subscription. All right, so, so this is just a, a, a volume one, so you will be learning a lot of uh, uh, other commands, combinations using of PowerShell, okay, with uh, Azure and the volume two. So stay tuned for more uh, uh, videos on, on, on this. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.